Good afternoon from Los Angeles, California. I'm Dr. Ryan Alva. Exactly, guys. I'd say about 100 people were out here tonight, and some of them even drove up from L.A. to participate. As you guys mentioned, these rallies have been happening for weeks. Monday will mark the sixth straight week in a row that we've seen these protests. Now, you could really hear the passion in everyone's voices who were out here tonight. The protesters started saying the name. Uh, they told me that the name of women's rights, that's how these protests really started. They're fighting for the rights of women. But that has now expanded, and now it's really the rights of all people in Iran. Now, everyone was chanting freedom for Iran, down with dictator, and women's rights, human rights. Now, some of the people I've spoken with have family and friends in Iran, and right now they're doing all they can to be a voice for their loved ones. The hope is that people of the world are going to hear our voices and are going to broadcast to their our demands to their governments. So We're here to support them and be their voice because, um, as you know, in Iran they have cut off the internet. It's very hard um, for them to communicate with the rest of the world. So we are trying to be their voice here in the United States. And and today was really just record breaking in the number of people who showed up and protested around the globe. I'm told more than 100,000 people took to the streets in Berlin. Of course, these protests are expected to continue. Reporting live downtown, Jasmine Ramirez, CBS 8. For my work, please click the subscribe, the like button, and the notification bell so you wouldn't miss any of my new videos.